Like I had to walk away from relationships yeah. that would even allow me to entertain who I used to be. Oh, man, that's my people. That's my blood. That's, you, we blood. Blood is thicker than anything, man. Sorry. What? Nah. Not when you have the calling of God. That's bigger than all things right mm. there. This is an Iwebu production. Period. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, TK. And it's your boy, Namdi. And you are here with the Iwebus yes. for our segment, AHA Moment. Did y'all miss it? Did y'all miss us? <laughs> <laughs> we are back with an AHA Moment, but... Yeah. A little different this will be a 10 minute aha moment we want yeah. to be able to give you a weekly uh yeah. dosage of just hope of encouragement yeah. of something that the lord has dropped in our spirit so baby yeah. drop it on them. the aha moment of the week is ascension can cause some tension yeah 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 so i mean baby you want to kind of elaborate on your yeah. side of how ascension can cause tension. Yes. I, I feel like I've experienced this in each season where, you know, when you feel like God is beginning to shed and remove things and you're like, what is this for? Yeah. I, I now know that that's when you are about to elevate. And mm. this doesn't mean that it's like a bunch of money or a bunch of this. Sometimes it's just mindset. Yeah. And with that being said, for my experience, when the Lord has brought me to a different season, mm -hmm. a higher level in him of maturity or whatever it might be, most times I had to leave people. Like I had to walk away from relationships yeah. that would even allow me to entertain who I used to be. Yeah. Bad habits, carnal yeah. conversations, yeah. Um, just being engaged in things that I knew that I had to get away from. Mm -hmm. And so because I knew that the Lord was bringing me to a new level, a higher yes. level in him, whether that was my career, yeah. whether that was me getting serious about motivation, I yeah. can't hang around a bunch of lazy people. Mm. I can't hang around a bunch of people that's eating bad. Yes. I can't hang around a bunch of gossipers and I'm a woman of intent. Integrity, and the Lord is calling me to a place. And so yes. most times my ascension usually, I, I don't, and probably for most, usually required me to leave people mm. behind and I love them. Yeah. You know what I mean? People I love them. I rocked with them for years and wow. years and years. And, it, and the crazy thing is the tension came from, it don't even matter. Most times when you, you can sit someone down and be like, you know what? Mm -hmm. I just feel the Lord is elevating me. This people going to feel some type of way. Really? So if you are going through a place or a season where the Lord is yeah. elevating you, I need you to know that people are going to feel away. Yeah. But if, if God said it, it, it got to get done yeah. and you want to be able you want to make sure that you are not idolizing old ways old groups yes. friends family yes. above god yes. if god told me to make this move that means there's better for me yes. and the crazy thing yes. just to add to that i had to leave to even show some people like there's there's better come on there's better than us just sitting yeah. around gossiping yeah. there's better than us just just simply working a job that we hate yeah. there's more let's strive yeah. for it and a lot of times it starts with a yeah. mindset yeah so yeah that's that's been my experience yeah and for me one of the things with ascension how it can cause some tensions is first a lot of times it can start inside with me mm. like it's it's a shock wave to my system. It's yeah. like, hold on, what, what are we, what are we doing now? <laughs> are we, we waking up at this time now? Mm. Hold on, we, we going to the Ooh. gym at this time now? Hold, whoa, whoa, usually we sleep in, homie. Well, oh, what, what are we doing now? We yeah. not, we not watching uh, this much TV no more. Yeah, we actually gonna watch and read more books, and we're gonna listen to more podcasts yeah. about what you're trying to do. Like it's causing tension in my mind. It's a tension, and it's it's the battle with the inner me. Yeah. Like it, and you may be having that battle right now, and that's that tension, okay? Because it's a shockwave. Because it's it's not what you're used to. Mm. You're shocking your system. Mm. You know, one of the things too for me is you know. I'll be honest, I struggle sometimes with being a little passive mm. on certain things, like really just, you know, kind of just letting things kind of go or whatever. But in this season, God has called me to be assertive, mm. like, OK, Come like on. you don't have to be aggressive, mean, none of that, but right. just be assertive. Yeah. Like when you see something that's wrong, no, speak up on that thing. Don't let it fester for months and months mm. and months. And then you bring it up and now you explode or anything like that. Yeah. So I had to I had to start doing that, man. Mm. I, I did that and it roughly some feathers with some people i had yeah. to i had to do that uh, i'll do it myself and then you know at first i had to say to myself and just so you know you may be saying this to yourself like 
am I a bad person? Especially for those who are ex people pleasers like myself. I'm yeah. a, I'm an ex people pleaser. I'm a recovering people pleaser. Y'all pray for me. Yeah. I want everybody to like me. Right. But guess what? When you start ascending mm. and people no longer can like have you at a certain place that they used to you being at. Yeah. Oh, that's gonna be a problem. It's a problem. That's gonna that's gonna be a problem. Yeah. And, and guess what? Those people no longer like you. Yeah. Those people may start saying some things about you, you whatever the case may be. Better. Yeah, it's it's gonna it for somebody like me, it could be hard sometimes. But to be honest with you, in this season, it has not been as much. Hmm. Because I believe we're on the horizon of something great. Yeah. Um, and so, uh, and I know that God wants to do something great. So he has to, some some people can't go like how, how they say, I know it's kind of cliche now because we didn't yeah. have so many motivational videos out, but some people really just can't go with you on this next level. It's not that they bad people. Right. It's not that they not successful in their own right or anything like that. Yeah. It's just for this. They they can't handle who you're becoming. Mm. They can't handle that next step. <clears throat> I have I have to cut some people out the circle. The Lord is like He starts pruning out these people because yeah. He's trying to insert these new people. The next person who you gonna connect to connect with, who's gonna be that that person to blow your business up. Yeah. The next person who you gonna connect with, who's gonna be that mentor that helps you go to that next level. He has to take some of those people, man. It might be some. It might be some family members. Mm. That's hard for some people right there. Yeah. Like you've been loving on, man. That's my people. That's my blood. That's you. We blood. Blood is thicker than anything, man. We love. Sorry. What? Nah, not, not, not when you got, not when you have the calling of God, that's bigger than all things right mm. there. You feel me? And so that can cause some tension also with family members, with some friends. Y'all may not talk as much as y'all used to or whatever the case may be. And so, yeah, they say more money, more problems ascension will cause some tension man and so i say just like someone who's in the gym and you working out you getting buff some of y'all right now y'all in february don't give up (laughs) y'all just got that membership i know that's you you just got that membership don't give up stay in there that tension you're having tension on your mind like dang am i really going to gym every day after work at this time Mm. dang you're feeling that soreness you don't like that soreness the diet that you own it's causing some tension right there man like you just want to go get them wings okay you just want to eat them pork rinds or something like that (laughs) like you want to get all those things right it's causing some tension in your diet okay it's causing some tension all together and people don't understand what's going on with you Mm -hmm. but i believe babe because we've been in this space and yeah. especially for myself yeah i just found this weird this weird peace come on jesus like this like like i really really like lord you're doing something and i feel it and sometimes i would say this too you might need to fast mm. because a lot of that clarity on what mm. was going on with me came during our fast absolutely and so you may need to fast just to see what what the lord is saying to you so yeah Ascension can bring some tension, man. And I just want to encourage you to continue break through the through the yeah. tension because, yeah. man, there's some greatness on the other side of that. Yeah, and I want to end it with just saying, know that the hardest the hardest part of ascending and elevating is the isolation season. Yeah. And so if you can press through the loneliness, yeah. if you can press through the heartbreak of disconnecting from people that you love, there is a better you on the other side. That person that you dream of, mm-hmm. that person that you know that God is calling you to be, listen, it's going to be tension yes. on the way up. And so we pray this helped you yes. and encouraged you and keeps you striving to Come be on. all all who God has called yes. you to be. Yes, it's just a part of the journey. Stay on the road to greatness, man. Ascension could cause some tension, man. Yes. But hey, I believe on the other side, it's going to be a big win for you. So, Absolutely. Hey, I hope this bless you. Yep. Uh, stay tuned for the next aha moment. We'll holla at you. Peace. Hey, thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you could do us a huge favor, please hit that like button and please subscribe. Yes, and please do not forget to hit that notification bell. We need y'all to be locked in every single time we drop this fire content. Also, we need y'all to follow us on all social media platforms at the Ewebus. And look, we will see y'all on the next video. Holla.